Hello all, in this video we are going to discuss about various interesting breastfeeding facts present in animals. The first on the list is the orangutan. It is a monkey species, endangered species. It has the interesting factor of having maximum lactation period among all the mammals that is up to 8 years. Orangutans can live up to 30 years of age. In its life it can give birth to maximum of 3 young ones because its lactation period is about 8 years. The next on the list is the Doyang fruit bat. It is the only species among the mammals where males can lactate their offsprings. Immediately after the birth of the offsprings, the male Doyang fruit bat starts eating estrogen containing leaves. Males produces breast milk for their offsprings. The next on the list is the hooded seal. This is a seal variety. The name hooded seal is derived from the inflated lips present here. The interesting fact about lactation in this mammal is that it has the lowest lactation period of about 4 days and it has the highest fat content of 68%. This is because this hooded seal cannot carry its young ones all along in sea so it will deliver the maximum energy containing milk within the 4 days immediately after the delivery. Next on the list is oposome. Oposome has the gestational period of about 12 days and it has multiple nipples all over the body. The younger oposomes will be very smaller, blind, deaf and its brain will be only 10% developed. Its only duty is to get attached to this nipples failing which it will die. After getting attached it locks its jaw and remain locked for nearly 2 months. During these 2 months it grows by 35 times than the birth weight. These nipples literally act like the placenta which is present during the antenatal period. The next on the list is kangaroo. Everybody thinks that kangaroo is a marsupial. It has a pouch. So that is the peculiarity about this mammal. No, with regarding to breastfeeding, it can produce two different types of milks for two different generations of young kangaroos at the same time. That is, it can produce high carbohydrate milk for the younger generation baby kangaroo and high fat content containing milk for the elder generation of kangaroo. The next on the list is dwarf mongoose. It is known for community lactation. That is, all the female dwarf mongoose can feed any baby present in that community. So the lactation is called as community lactation. The next on the list is platypus and echidna. These two are egg laying mammals. Mammals usually give birth to their young ones, does not lay egg. The exceptions are here, that is platypus, this, this is the flat animal, platypus, the flat animal and echidna which is a porcupine like animal. These two are egg laying mammals. The next on the list is your cow, goat, sheep, giraffe, squirrel which has the hind breast which means the breast will be present in the later half of the later half or the distal half of the body. Next on the list is the elephant. Elephant has the armpit breast that is the uh, breast is present in the axilla region. The peculiarity about the elephant breast is it is present in the armpit. The last in the list is the human species, the only species known for bottle feeding. Probably all the animals have understood that breast milk is the best milk and the fact is yet to be understood by humans. Thank you very much for, for watching this video.